you've seen the news recently, you might come across a couple articles talking about how Dave Chappelle got attacked on stage. Or you might have watched the showdown happen on YouTube. Or on Twitter. And I do have to say, it is the saddest attempt at harming someone that I've ever witnessed. If you don't know who Dave Chappelle is, he's an American stand-up comedy <laughs> dude. He's most notable for his, uh, for his own show called The Dave Chappelle Show. Is this a five o'clock free crack giveaway? <laughs> that's, that's where he does stand-up comedy in, in the show. He just puts in a bunch of skits and puts some some jokes in between each skit. But he was also criticized for making jokes towards the transgender community. Anyways, what happened was, while Dave Chappelle was performing at Los Angeles, a random guy in the front row climbed up onto the stage and tried to tackle Dave Chappelle. But what happened was he fell before he even tackled him down. Dave did trip, but he didn't like fall face first and just just flopped over like the other guy did. Take take a look at this. Producers that hip hop has ever presented, the mighty man Lil. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for hip hop history. Dude looks like a cartoon character the way he falls. <laughs> he also clearly didn't have this planned out because right after he fell, he ran backstage. That is such a stupid idea. You might as well just jump into the crowd at that point. So now that he ran backstage, he, he's cornered, obviously, because both on the right and left side of the stage. So Dave Chappelle is like uh, right here, right? And then there's a wall right here and the guy that tackled him he ran right here and right here there's an opening there's an opening on two sides right here and right here this guy walked over behind the wall and then and then a crowd of people just a bunch of people uh walked here and then the other uh crowd of people walked over here to corner him i also love like how he's running away there are like m there are multiple people that are clearly seen slipping it's like the stage is made out of ice. And then for the cherry on top, there's a girl in the background that you can faintly hear say, really just made my day. So then the guy was jumped by a group of people and brought to the ambulance with visible injuries. And while he was being brought to the ambulance, you can clearly hear people in the, in the crowd watching him go by, just boo at him. Back up! That has to be the most embarrassing thing ever. You fail at attempting to assault someone, and then you get beaten up, and then the whole crowd just starts booing at you. He was then later arrested and identified as Isaiah Lee. He was uh, accused, he was actually accused of carrying a deadly weapon, which I did forget to bring up. This guy had a replica gun, but it's not like a real gun, though the attachment to it was a real knife that's what made the whole weapon dangerous which is pretty scary nobody knew what he had on him at first luckily throughout the whole thing dave chappelle wasn't harmed at all in fact after the attacker ran backstage dave chappelle got back up grabbed the microphone and started spilling some jokes thank god that was clumsy goo goo gaga i'm a baby he literally just started to make fun of the situation, which I have to find is absolutely chat of him to do. Chris Rock was actually there too, you know, the one that got assaulted by Will Smith. He also joked about it and asked if the attacker was Will Smith, which brings me to something else. I recently saw that after Will Smith slapped Chris Rock because Chris Rock made fun of his wife. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? Bruh. People started to assume that it was okay to harass or attack celebrities for no reason or no good reason. And I know it does sound like a bit of a stretch, but what I personally think is that Will Smith was the, the catalyst for all of this. After Will Smith slapped Chris Rock, a passenger on a plane 
harassed and was accused of throwing a water bottle at Mike Tyson. And then you have Dave Chappelle being attacked by a random guy on stage. So Will Smith's slap might have actually led up to Dave Chappelle being attacked. Someone summed it up this way. Comedians have been attacked physically since comedy existed. It's just that when Will Smith did it, he finally gave it a commercial. That's pretty much all I wanted to say. The guy that attacks Dave Chappelle is an absolute troglodyte and he deserves to be in prison. If you like this kind of content, I would be so grateful if you subscribed and liked the video. Also, make sure to check out one of my close friends Instagram makes props and recently made a sword which is actually pretty insane. Link is in the description.